Alba. And this is Sonia. And this is Everything Art, where the table is also art. Today we are making paper boats. Now let's get sailing. Get your paper. Always have your paper. Now, fold it in half, nice and perfect, because this is a hard thing to do. I've got it wrong multiple times. You don't want to see the outcomes. Anyway, fold it in half. You've got your rectangle. Now fold it again. There's going to be a lot of folding. Yeah, I know. That's what I said. Anyway. <laughs> Why isn't this folding? One second. <laughs> yeah, okay. Great, we folded it. Sadly, we won't get to keep it like this. Open it up again, like this, just still here. A book. book. Great, I'm done reading. Now, you, if you remember our last video, the paper airplane, do the same thing, except with the boats, like, like that, on each side. Straight on the line, parallel, this is good for your math teachers. They will enjoy you doing this. They will recommend this to you. So then you want to fold it nice and parallel with that line. Great. Now what you want to do, you have to, remember you have to fold it on the closed side. That is very important. If you get that wrong, you will have to start over. Forgot to mention. Anyway, now you take your open side. You take your open side, it's and the hot it's not. so then you do this, and on each side. Whoops! Oh, the hat part. Put my book back on the water. Next. So, if you want to stop there, you will have a pretty good hat. But if you don't want to start th stop there and make your paper boat, you will keep going. <laughs> So actually, we're going to need this hat to open. So we're going to do that. Oh, and you want to slightly tuck one under because it helps a lot. Trust me. So then you want to have your square. Don't forget your right angle, kids. Again, this is good for math. So <laughs> you have your perfect triangle. Not perfect. Okay. So then, triangle, take it, and... Open side, take the open side, open side. And you will fold this beautiful square into a triangle. One I'm more math to... lesson. Let's do one more math lesson, okay? A triangle's angles always equal up to 180 degrees. He did not know that. See, I'm genius. Great. So, then you have a smaller head. I just noticed this. It'll keep getting smaller. If you want to keep doing this procedure. So then, again, you have to. Great. Again. One half! Yeah. If you want a bigger boat that is less sturdy, in my opinion, you want to go the next step. But if you don't want to, you will open it here and you will have like a bigger boat. But I'm going to go to the next step. Now, again, we'll get bored of this step a lot. <laughs> Fold it into a triangle. Do you remember that step? Okay. And she's. Fold the hot pot. And oh my god. An even smaller hat. Great, so your smaller hat. Again, oh my gosh, do you remember this? Tell me what the step is. <laughs> triangle. <laughs> this might not be the neatest. Oh, great. Okay, so what you need to do now is definitely the hard part. Oh, crap. That what? looks... That lo doesn't look good. So it's... Because it's not done. It looks like a lotus right now. Lotus casino. I want a lotus cookie. Anyway. You flatten this. Uh, so sloppy. You better than her. Yes, you better than me. I beg of you. This is a very, very hot origami piece. Yes, it is. So 
So then you have I don't need it for me. And, <laughs> and if you again don't want to be a poopy pants and be a party pooper. Yeah. You will decorate. <laughs> Favorite part? Random dots. Yeah, I just do random dots. <laughs> and squares. This is fun. <laughs> I wish to drop a bucket of paint on this at the moment. But then it won't be able to set sail. I know, I know. That's why I'm not doing it. Well, that is how you make a paper boat. So, well, I'm going to head off to the beach so I can catch this sweet ride. See you there. Mm-hmm.